Well, it's a nice day to be on call. Sunday, it's raining. Got a call for this unit not working. And nothing is running. No fans, no compressor. Southern KSAR. Yeah, no power. Well, that makes sense why it doesn't work. That's a maybe. Oh. <clears throat> you gotta run your fingers across them because sometimes they'll be tripped and you won't even know it. All right, so we've got a lobster unit that's tripped. We've got this one, so we got a lot of them tripped in this in this box. This would do one at a time, huh? That one, no good. That's a 240, so that's not the one. That one, no good. That one no good. Okay, that one reset. Let's go see. So I found another set of breakers hidden and uh, we've got one tripped right there. Right, let's go see. Okay, so whenever you run into this stupid problem of where you can't find a breaker, you let an electrician do that. You get your job done and go. So we're going to see if this unit works, or if it doesn't work, or if it's the reason the breaker tripped in the first place. Nothing too alarming here. Look good. We've got a clear side glass. It's nice when you got those side glasses on these little tiny units. That liquid line is kind of warm though. running a good 15-20 minutes and it's looking good so we're gonna blow it up with some nitrogen and tell him he needs to get an electrician So 
uh, I got it clean. That's basically gonna wrap it up. I uh, used some some wet paper towels to kind of help block the dust, but dust is gonna get dust is gonna get out no matter how hard you try. There's only so much you can do with that. So tell the manager that he needs to call an electrician because my work here is done. This unit works. get some power to the unit or to this outlet right here and it'll work so that's it i will see you guys later